knees on his feet. I throw my head, my, heel, my shoulder goes to my heel, I put his leg does. Tail that leg's already swinging out. All I have to do is level change again, take my chest to his ankle. Okay, so I'm here, I hit my dump. This doesn't work if I don't try to hit my dump. All right, because then I'm all this weight goes back this way. Hit my dump, let that leg swing out, make this leg light. Let my chest slide to his ankle. What you guys are gonna wanna do is you're gonna back out. Back out. Just level change my chest to it. Now up and into him. Up and into him. Couple details. Once we get his leg up high, don't square up to him. Look how long this leg is. Okay? Look how long that is. If I go like this, I have to fight his whole leg. Right? Stay perpendicular to him. Look how much closer that leg is now. See that? It's just right here. I know where it's at. Don't square up. It's going to be hard to get pressure into him and trip him. So as I go to dump, let this leg swing out. I dump, that leg swings out. Boom, chest to it. Get it high. Stay perpendicular. My right hip, not away from him, into him. Right here. Get him bouncing, get him bouncing. Trip. Or if he's really tall like TJ, it's hard to trip him. Elevate and hop him. Got it? So here, don't back out. Level change into him. Right? Either get him to hop and time it. If he's just too tall. Elevate, elevate. I'm blocking his foot. I'm not trying to pull it. I'm just blocking it. Until he falls. Got it? So go ahead. One, two.